Hey everyone and welcome back to BetaNex. Are you ready for something groundbreaking? OpenAI just dropped a major update for ChatGPT and it's a game changer. Yes, I'm talking about the memory feature. That's right, ChatGPT can now remember our past conversation. This means no more starting from scratch every time you chat. Instead, ChatGPT builds on what you have discussed before leading to more personalized and engaging interactions. So. What are the benefits of this memory feature? Well, let's count the ways. But before that, you all know that AI is taking over the world in such a short span of time. We have seen so many layoffs, million of jobs replaced by AI and whatnot. You don't want to get affected by this recession wave, right? Well, AI won't replace you, but the person using AI will. If you want to save your job and become irreplaceable in your career, join us 3 hours AI tool workshop in which we will teach you about the best AI tools to upskill increase your productivity and enhance your career. Now, let's quickly cover the OpenAI announcement. They are saying, we are testing the chat GPT's ability to remember things you discussed to make future charts more helpful. This feature is being rolled out to a small portion of free and plus users and it's easy to turn off and on i unfortunately am not one of those small portion of users but let's take a look at announcement so memory and new control for chat gpt they are saving we are testing memory with the chat gpt remembering the things you discuss across all chat saves you from having to repeat information and makes future conversations more helpful. You are in control of ChatGPT's memories. You can explicitly tell it to remember something, ask it what it remembers and tell it to forget conversationally or through settings. You can also turn it off on entirely. So a few people are already getting it and they have plans to start rolling out to everyone pretty soon. So how it works? is as you are chatting back and forth with the help of chat gpt you can tell it remember something specific or let it pick up the details itself chat gpt memory will get better the more you use it and you are going to start to notice improvements over time for example let's say you have explained that you prefer to have meeting notes with headline bullets and action items summarized at the bottom chat gpt will remember that can recap meanings in this way moving forward let's say you have told chat gpt you own a neighborhood coffee shop when brainstorming message for a social post celebrating a new location chat gpt will know where to start you mentioned that you have a toddler and she loves jellyfish when you ask chat gpt to help create her birthday card it's just a jellyfish wearing a party hat and if you are a teacher it will remember information about your students when making lesson plans etc and of course you control you can switch it off anytime in settings personalization memory if you have access to this you will have this new tab called personalization so if you log in in chat gpt click on your name in the bottom left settings and see if you have that personalization tab and if you wanted to forget something just tell it interestingly you can view and delete specific memories in that same personalization and manage memory so as you can see here it looks like chat gpt it's remember some of the things you have told it whether that's through things it selects to by itself to remember or things you have explicitly told it to remember and you are able to delete them one at a time wouldn't you love to have that with the people it's just like i lo no longer want you to remember this thing about me and they are saying your memories like the models it will be trained on those to improve the models for everyone you can turn this off in data control and as always they don't train for they don't train on content from chat gpt teams and enterprise customers so if you are using it for your business that data doesn't get used for training future models and they also add a temporary chart similar to the incognito window for chrome browser so if you don't want it using your memories just use that temporary chart won't appear in the history won't use memory and won't be used to train our models so custom instruction you can still use them to provide direct guidance for your explicit information instructions you can add it to your custom instruction so these memories seem to be more fluid ongoing thing 
that you can change quickly that will be outdated automatically and i think this is going to be a lot easier for the people to think of automatically start customizing their own chat gpt like it's going to start learning from what they want and who they are to improve its capabilities and they are saying there is obviously certain sensitive you know the sensitive information like your health details and it's not going to remember unless you explicitly ask it to and they are also saying how team and enterprise customers how this will benefit from ai although this is true for everyone for example if you have a certain writing tone or a voice this will automatically apply them for example your blog post if you are a coder you will remember certain preference like your programming languages and framework models which you should streamline the process for monthly business reviews you securely upload your data to chat gpt and it creates your preferred chats with three takeaways this is a huge you know if you are running a business at the end of every month you teach chat gpt how you know all your transactions whether that's your recording or whatever other metrics what other data you look at every single month just upload it to chat gpt and it's going to know it's going to have that skill about what you want doing it with organizing into categories or format that excel sheet however you put on out and a few charts with the bullet points etc this is actually a very cool and gpts will also have a memory so those custom gpts if you are building gpts they will have their own distinct memory as a builder you have the options to enable memory for the gpt now those memories will be shared with the builders so if you are interacting with that gpt and you found on this too will remember things about you but those won't be shared with the makers of the gpt the builders but it sounds like the builders will have to allow it so that they will have to turn that on sort of for example the books gpt help you find your next street with a memory enabled it remembers your preference such as your favorite genre or top books and trailer the recommendations you accordingly and those memories are not shared between the gpt so it sounds like your gpt kind of the central area where you talk to the chat gpt that's going to have its own memory and each custom gpt that has that opinion enabled will have its own sort of the set of the memories i got to say this that that's pretty exciting a lot of these customizations already exist for large companies whether you are at amazon or a google or they do it on you they have memories about you here it looks like you are going to be able to see what those memories are you will be able to control them add to them delete from them so i got to give props to open ai for being well pretty open instead of doing this kind of behind the scenes you are control and you are able to adjust as needed so i got to say i love this so far thanks for joining us today do not forget to like and subscribe for more tech updates and let us know in the comment below what do you think about the chat gpt's memory feature this was ushma signing off until next time